what's going on my friend welcome to the channel I am Yvonne here, here with you about to do your Taurus Gemini cusp reading right so come on in put your feet down relax about to get into your cards right now okay so how are you doing enjoying yourself so far yeah it's a weekend you know what I mean hope you're doing good things being safe you know all right so I'm gonna give a shout out to my subscribers and my members how can I not Thank you for your likes, your shares, your subscribes, and your comments, right? You guys are A1 fantastic. I love it. All right, so let me just shuffle this up. I did that, right? Disclaimer. Oh, yeah, the disclaimer. Guess what? This is your stuff. It's not mine. So when I find it out, and I'm going to, uh, you know, just remember it's your stuff, and we'll work it through. <laughs> Too easy. Yeah, baby. All right. So, you ready? Let's get to it. Here's your first card. Look at that. Page of Pentacles. Yeah, Page of Pentacles. Hmm. That's a good start. Let's see the second card here. What's this all about? Well, that second card is... Oh, looks like you want to give something to somebody. You got the Six of Pentacles, the Page of Pentacles, right? Maybe... Uh, you know, you want to give something to somebody when it's, it has to do with some finances, right? Obviously, some money's going on here. But more or less, it's like uh, the roles could be reversed. So somebody could be wanting to give you this money, right? Bring a little balance into your life, right? Let's just uh, work this out and figure out what's going on with this. This, this looks pretty good for you. Okay. Good. There's your first card in your story. Ooh. Well, now, maybe someone's going to give you some money into, like, doing some kind of research, right? Doing, um, I wouldn't say spying, just more like gathering information, right? So maybe this is a job, right? Maybe you're going to raise. Ooh, wouldn't that be nice? Heck yeah. All right. Let's keep going and figure this out. Let's see. What's this page of swords? Okay. Well, the, the decision has been on pause, right? So, it's like, whoever is going to give you this, it looks definitely like a raise, right? Um, but you're going to have to really do some research. Like, maybe there's more work involved, right? And so the decisions, it, it's already been made, right? But it hasn't taken effect yet, okay? So it's not kicked in. Let's kick it. Yeah. It's not quite in effect, okay? Maybe they're still looking into you. Yeah, that's what it is. They're still looking into you, right? And, and they're waiting to just then all of a sudden um, let the funds <laughs> be dispersed, right? That's what I'm seeing. Okay, that's what I'm hearing. Let's keep going. Hit those like buttons for me. Subscribe if you have not. There it is. Okay, so there's a little bit of worry here. They might be worried about something with you. Okay, because this is still their energy, right? Oh, okay, so there's a little bit of stress, a little bit of worry. Maybe you're having this anxiety because you know what's going to happen, but it just hasn't happened yet. So that could build your uh, anxiety and a little bit of stress. Because you're definitely looking to have some of this moolah. My moolah, baby. <laughs> Here's the next card. Are you ready? There it is. Okay, well you now fear that you're gonna have to take on extra work. Extra work, this is the Eight of Pentacles. Yeah, the Eight of Pentacles with the uh, Nine of Swords definitely says, you have some stress about putting in more work. I mean, you're really good at what you do, this is why they're looking at you, right? But, um, hmm. let's get serious. I heard it. I told you. I told you that these people are definitely checking you out. Right? It's the hermit. They're analyzing you. Big time. With a microscope. Right? They're like checking you right out. Let's keep on going. Wow, that's kind of heavy. <laughs> heavy, heavy. Three of cups, okay? Don't get excited yet, my friend. They're they're still looking. They're still analyzing, right? I know you're waiting. It's kind of painful. I feel you, Amelia. But, you know, just got to go with it. 
Just like these cards. I'll get your next one. <laughs> All right, three of cuppies. Yeah, three of cuppies with the three of pentacles. Yeah. So you're gonna have to, you know, um, wait for your excitement, okay? Because you know it's coming, right? Most of y'all, and um, you know. You're going to have friends that are going to celebrate with you, right? They're going to be happy for you, right? Three of Pentacles, three of Cups. That's good. That's really good. Okay? So nice, right? So this is definitely a work environment. This is your finances, your career, your J-O-B. Let's go. Here's the next card. Ace of Cups. Wow. Isn't this magnificent? Ace of Cups, that just totally makes you so emotionally fulfilled. It's, it's amazing, right? And this is definitely a new opportunity, right? A new opportunity to feel a different way, to be more, um, you know, on the higher vibe side, right? Higher vibe side. Say that five times fast. While you're hitting the like button. <laughs> Here you go. High Priestess. All right. High Priestess under the Hermit, that's pretty heavy energy. That's like super heavy energy, right? So there, this this company, your boss, whoever, um, they're really, really like looking at you with a fine tooth comb, right? But they're gonna trust their intuition because this energy is flip floppy. It goes back and forth, back and forth, forth and back. You know what I mean? Uh, between yours and theirs, meaning this person who's coming in to give you the moolah. Right, it's all about the Benjamins right now, baby. Yeah, so what they're gonna do is they're gonna trust their intuition for sure. And they're gonna really know what to do, okay? Because like I said, it's on the verge of you getting this kind of, ooh, man, there it is. You're on the verge of getting this kind of balance, this even give and take, right, this extra money, right? Page of Pentacles, Six of Pentacles. But now, they're gonna trust that you know what to do with this project. So you are gonna have to put in some more work. Okay, because now with the Ace of Wands, it's an opportunity for you to what? <sighs> Start a project. And it's this company, this boss, these people, this person that is gonna give you this extra money, this raise, this bonus. Um, because you are skilled at what you do, you're gonna have to put in that time, okay? And you're kind of happy about it, right? Your friends are happy for you because you're getting a promotion, you're getting a raise, you're going up the ladder, you know what I mean? And that's super good, okay? Okay, good, too easy, All right? So let's keep going with the Ace of Wands, the Priestess, full card, there's a new journey, I told you, sucker. You better listen to me, right? I'm telling what I'm telling you exactly what's going on. <laughs> right. There it is. Fool's journey. Right? Staring right at the ace of wands. So you're gonna take a leap of faith with the with this project for sure. You, my friend, are definitely gonna do it. Okay? And I like this for you because it's something in your niche. It's something in, in what you you can do that you're really good at. Okay, so you got this. And it's definitely going to make you elated, right? You're going to be super happy with the Ace of Cups. So two Aces out here. Nice. Well, surprisingly, I mean, we got another Major out here. So that's that's okay. We got three Majors. Two Aces. It's looking good. It's all in your favor, right? Told you it was an institution, business, and organization. Corporation. Mm -hmm. There it is, right there, right? So you're going to go into a different level, okay? So maybe you're getting promoted to the fourth floor, right? So now you're going um, from, like, the mailroom to HR. Just saying. You know what I mean? Human resources. Yeah. So you're definitely leveling up. Another major. Well, we just keep talking about these majors, so they're going to keep coming out. So you better hit that like button, and I'll give you another one. Okay. Hard work is coming. Yeah, see, you knew it. You're stressed about it, and it's true. Right? So sometimes what we think is what happens. <laughs> you really manifest it that way, right? That's the whole part of it. Law of attraction, manifestation, right? <whistles> you thought it, and you knew it was true because you, you have this intuition too, right? Let's go bang. There it is. You're going to have to put in the hard work with this new um, level up for you. Right? But you're still good at it. So it's not really going to bother you that much. It's not going to really mess with your whole, oh my God, right? And now you can't even perform in your job. It's not going to be that way. 
right. Wow, isn't this is a little sassy reading? Yeah. There it is. Okay, you're gonna have options, right? So nice. Maybe before you were stuck with options, maybe you just you just keep giving to the job, giving to the job, and you weren't really getting anything out of it. Now you get an opportunity to really get something back out of it. And and you're gonna have options in this. Options in the way that you perform your duty, in the way that you uh, present your you know your work, all that stuff. Um, maybe different ideas right nice what you got going on hmm all right hopefully smashing that like button right and becoming a member subscribe bam there it is you got this you got this this is too easy you can juggle this you can you make this juggling look easy a lot of people wouldn't be able to handle this kind of multitasking these options into really putting the work, quality work, out, right? But you make it look easy. <laughs> Two pebbles. That's beautiful. I'm loving it. Ba, 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 ba. Let's keep going. All right. Final card. And then we'll get your outcome. Look at this. Cha-ching. Payday, baby. Payday. This is all for you. Look at that. Ten of pentacles. Great. This is going to build your legacy. This is going to definitely, be, obviously, increase your finances because you were at the six. Now you're at the ten. I think the math is obvious. Let's keep going. All right. Here comes your outcome. Your grand slam. Your home run. Your chocolate chips on your pancakes. You know what I mean? Here is your verdict. Number one. What are you doing? <laughs> Okay, so we were a little foreshadowing of what was going to happen because it still hasn't really kicked in yet because you have that three of wands. So now this is all knowing which, what's really the outcome for you. And uh, you're like stressed about when it's going to happen because it's lined up. Right. <clears throat> wow. All right. Let's get this last card. <laughs> Sure. All right. This is the icing on the cake. The whipped cream with the cherry on top. Look at that. Ciao. Yeah. Queen of Wands. Sword. Wand swords. Hey, yeah. hey, let's just name them all. Right? <laughs> Queen of Cups. Eight of Swords. What are you doing? You got your back turned towards this emotionally. Well, no. It's like you're still emotionally invested, right? You still want to go ahead even though you're like, I'm not even sure. I'm just wondering when the hell is this going to happen? I mean, they laid the plane out for me, but now it's like, when's the plane going to kick in? Right? So that, that throws your mind right out the window. Right? Right in the trash. And so then your emotions are here being like, okay, I'm still ready. That's you with your cup. You want to pour your cup into this because you have the Ace of Cups right here, baby. Okay. So you're still emotionally invested in this, but your logic is now kind of starting to go um, south. <laughs> so I think let's just pull two more cards here and see how this is going to work out. Yeah, I almost wanted to grab an Oracle card for you, but I don't think you need it. Let's go. Okay, you definitely are going to um, block out your mind. Yep, see, seven of wands blocking out the overthinking, right? You're going to really take charge of that, right? You're not going to let it stop you, right? Right, because sometimes we do. We let it stop us. Dead in our tracks, baby. All right, here we go. The final card for you, my friend, is this. Bam, you stand ready. Look, I'm standing ready. Boom, the message comes in. You started with the page, you're ending with the page. Nice. Now you're gonna force me to do another card. Because that's like the message. Because you're standing ready. You're blocking out the overthinking, right? You're still emotionally invested. And wow, the lover's card. Interesting. Wow, this puts you in perspective really quickly. Okay, so this, once you get word that, because this is going to happen, right? This is going to settle down. This is going to happen, right? So when it does, um, in your 
knowing the plan, because that's how you guys do it, um, you just can't wait. So then that starts trapping your mind, right? You're still emotionally invested. But now when this kicks in, because you get the message, um, it snaps you in your duality. So now you're back back in balance with your emotions and your logic. Because here with the Eight of, eight of Swords, you're overthinking. Um, and then you know, with the Queen of Cups, you're invested. So now you pull yourself together. You overcome this challenge of this overthinking of when is this going to happen? And that puts you in that duality with the lover's card and it happens real fast with the eight of wands wow I mean I just want one more <laughs> I'm just getting kind of greedy with this I love it this is a great reading for you guys no time alright victory and success see I knew I had to pull another card because it will be fine so don't sweat the small stuff okay stay out of your head it's going to work out perfect for you so I'm really loving this reading for you guys but that's it you know what I mean so with that being said, enjoy the rest of your weekend. Be safe, be blessed, be brave, and be well, my friends. Hey, tell everybody about my channel. Please, just go out there and say, hey, you know this guy? You gotta, you gotta check out his readings, right? He's a really cool guy, and he's got some good good uh, messages, right? But binge my playlist too, right? Go back a year, go back two weeks, six weeks, whatever. Compare what happened in your life then to the tarot card message at that time. Feel free to leave me comments, right? But smash the buttons, smash them, crush them, beat them up, right? Let's get this circulated to other people, right? It helps my channel, supports my channel, and that would show love to me in a tremendous way. So appreciate that, my friends. Enjoy yourself, be blessed, and be brave. Well, peace and prayer every day. And I'll see you on the next one.